everybody welcome back to a glittery life I'm sorry if it looks like I'm sitting a little bit like crooked or a little bit weird I'm trying to keep my like little like cast like propped up because if I sit with it like hanging off the edge of the bed it just like makes my like foot like throb so let me try to get myself like situated a little bit for you so anyway that's why I'm a little bit crooked I'm like actually leaning this way so well welcome back to a glittery life and um, I have my February favorites for you. I cannot believe how fast February went. I mean, granted, it's like a short month, but still, it was, it just felt like it went by in a blink of an eye. But I had some really, like, major standout products that I just am really loving that I've thought, I'm like, you know what, I think I'll do a favorites. I don't always do a monthly favorites. I try to, but I just, this week, but this month, I just felt like I had to do a monthly favorites for you. First off, on my lips, I'm wearing NARS Audacious in Barbara. It is such a great nude. I love it. It's a little bit peachier of a nude. Um, and I just have just found myself gravitating to it a lot. That or Vera, because Vera matches my hair. And so I feel like I'm wearing either nude or I'm wearing like, I'm like being matchy matchy with my hair. I know. I don't know if that's even cool or not. I don't know. Um, I had a foundation this month that I just that really took me by surprise. I can't believe that I loved it as much as I did. It's definitely the It Cosmetics Celebration Foundation. My shade is light medium for my nice fair skin. And honestly, I, I think I told you before, and I mentioned this in another video, and I said that I haven't worn like a powder foundation in like over a decade. I really haven't. I never thought that I would like this. I tried it one day kind of like on a fluke where I was just like, well, I guess, I don't know, I'll try this. I have it. Like they sent it to me. I, I should see what the fuss is about. And honestly, I was like, what? My skin? It's not what I'm wearing today. I'm testing out another foundation that I cannot wait to tell you about. I'm really excited about. It is a brand new launch of a new product from Cover FX. So anyway, that's actually what's on my skin today. If it looks beautiful, thank you. If not, I don't know, keep it to yourself. So anyway, I if you are looking for a full coverage powder foundation that goes the distance and lasts all day, Honestly, this little mug right here is incredible. I noticed that I could get like 15 to 18 hours out of this on days where I just needed to look flawless all day long. I could wear this all day. I didn't have to retouch. I didn't have to touch my skin up. It didn't break down around my pores. Like I have like everything seems to break down around my nose and kind of like on my forehead is where like if a product's going to break down, that's where it's going to break down. I never had this happen with this. So on days that I was just working a lot or working really crazy long hours, this this was really my go-to and it really took me by surprise in the most pleasant way so just a great like five stars like thumbs up for this product another product that you might be sick of hearing me talk about but I just can't tell you how much I really genuinely like it is the cover effects contour kit I have it on today and it's just perfect for your like everyday contour oops I mean, you can definitely see that it is getting used. And you know what, honestly, one of the things that's so cool about this kit is this highlight shade right here, Moonlight. It is so pretty for a cream highlight. And I just, I don't know, I really love cream products. It's just really natural and looks really beautiful. So I just, I have, I've had this on repeat legitimately all month and I don't see that stopping anytime soon. Um, something else that I really, really liked this month was the NYX Micro Brow Pencil and in the shade Auburn, which is a little bit kind of like a light, lightish brown because I just, I don't know, I didn't want my brows like super dark with my hair like this and this has kind of been the perfect like brown, like r reddish, like ruddy tone, like red brown for like my brows. It's what I'm using right now. Um, and I don't know, I just, I, it's been a great product for me. I, I've been using this one and then one of the darker ones too. So I really like it and it's from the drugstore. So it's like cheap. Can't go wrong with that. Um, something else that I've really liked for my lips and that I've reached for a lot is the Buxom White Russian Gloss. I never make a dent in gloss. I can see like where I've like made a dent in this gloss, like where I've been using so much of it. I just typically don't wear gloss, but I, I don't know why. I've had this on my vanity all month and I just am like, oh cool, I finished my face and then I just put White Russian on. It's just been super easy. So all of you who told me to get White Russian, thank you. You were right. Um, okay, 
if you've been around a glittery life for a while, you know I don't frequently like rave about mascara. I don't have a holy grail mascara. I mean, probably if I was gonna have a holy grail mascara, it'd be like Lorac Pro or like Better Than Sex from Too Faced. But I don't know. I mean, I like them. I'm not repurchasing them like crazy. I've repurchased them before, uh, both multiple times, but it's not the thing that I'm like, if I'm out of, I'm not like, oh my gosh, what am I gonna do? It's not like that. And right now I have like 20 mascaras that I'm supposed to be trying and I have like a stack of mascaras and I'm trying to be really good this year about only having one maximum two open mascaras at a time. But I have to tell you this nude sticks mascara and it's just in the black shade is awesome. I actually found a mascara that I really love and I mean, I don't know why it's so good but it is so good. It just has a regular spoolie, like nothing special, nothing unique, nothing like crazy technology, but it grabs your lashes so well. So like that, like lift and rock motion is awesome. And it's a nice creamy kind of wet consistency that doesn't get clumpy ever, but you can really build it up. Like you can put a couple layers of this on and just have these like really ba-bam lashes without having like tarantula legs coming out your baby blues. You know what I'm talking about? So if you're looking for uh, a new mascara to try, uh, I'm gonna put a link down below for this. I know Beautylish carries this, and so I am actually trying to be better about like listing stuff down below. So I'm gonna list everything that I talked about today down below, and um, I'll list the Beautylish link for this in case you haven't ever shopped at Beautylish before. Make it easy for you. Um, speaking of Beautylish, another kind of like unexpected surprise this last month was the Wayne Goss 7 brush and I got this in my Beautylish Lucky Bag. This is actually a lip brush but you know what this is perfect for? Smudging your um, like lower lash line with shadow. I typically do not use a pencil liner on my lower lash line. If I do I'll smudge it out but I never have that hard pencil line. I think it looks so contrived and so cheap and so I smudge everything out on that lower lash line and this little lip brush honestly it's so weird it's the it fits perfect there it's so delicate it is the perfect smudge brush you can pick up product really well not a lot of fallout and so i don't know if you're on the hunt for like a really good like smudge brush or lip brush if you will that's what this is really for um they have beautylish also i mean it's wayne goss so i'll link the, i'll put a link down to the for this too okay now you guys, I actually have a giveaway this like for this favorites video because I just had to give you a pair of these because they're so good. Okay, so this is these are the waxing lounge tweezers. You know, my best friend lives in Northern California and has this like really sexy like wa waxing lounge. It's called the waxing lounge and in Redding, California, and it is so hot. The, it's so cool. Well, she's been a brow expert. I mean, like industry expert, like she consults for some of the biggest high-end brands that you all love. Um, but I'm not going to be all bougie and name drop. But anyway, she's legit. She's the real deal. She made her own tweezers. So she had, she designed these, had them manufactured and they are bomb. They are so sharp. They are so, they have such a good point to them. They're calibrated amazingly. So you can pull those hairs out instead of breaking them off. Cause a lot of times a sharp tweezer will actually break the hair off instead of pull it out. And that does not help anybody, especially on the like chin hair right here. You don't want it to break off. You want to dislodge it. So I was like, you know what? We've got to like do something. We've got to give these away because people have to know about these. This is like one of those like best kept secrets and y'all would be really mad at me um, if I didn't tell you about this. So two of you are going to have a chance to win these. Um, I will list all, I will list how to enter and everything in the drop down menu. Um, but I really cannot wait for two of you to win these. I wish you could all win them. And I have a promo code for you so that you can get free shipping on these tweezers. So I will link the website, how to get these, all of that kind of stuff. Cause I know you're going to be like, Oh, I always love a good pair of tweezers. So anyway, if you, I, I, she gave me some sort of code so that you guys can get free shipping and I will put that in the drop down menu as well as well as a link so that it makes it easy for you to get to these you guys i'm like really trying to get my link game and like my list game on point for you taking it to the next level so thumbs up if you like that thumbs up if that's helpful thumbs up if you like my scarf thumbs up if it rained at your house i mean you know what i mean thumbs up blah 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 just thumbs up the videos okay you guys thanks 
So anyway, congratulations in advance to two of you who are going to get their lives changed by these two tweezers. And um, if you stay, stick around to the end of the video, I'm actually going to put a little video clip of my best friend Shannon um, talking about these tweezers and it's worth the sticking around for, you'll laugh. Okay, another favorite. Honestly, you guys, I hate that I'm talking about this because I know you can't get it, but I got to keep it real. The Lorac Mega Pro. I mean, this thing is like, I, I don't need any other eyeshadow. I could give away everything else that I have. I'm not going to because that would be crazy. I mean, don't get it twisted. What am I, who am I trying to kid? I can't give away any eyeshadow. But anyway, you guys, this palette is so amazing. If you ever see anybody who's selling one of these and you don't have to give like a kidney and like your hair for it, get it because you will thank me. It's really awesome. And those of you who have it, high five. We're in the Lorac Mega Pro uh, Club. I honestly think this might be my, I have like probably three eyeshadow formulas that are my favorite Lorac being in the top three so you can't beat that and my very last favorite of the month y'all don't hate because I just got these like the last week of February but honestly if you were me you would include these in your favorites too because they're so good it's the NARS dual intensity blushes oh my gosh you guys I cannot stop wearing them um I am wearing this one today right here that is um frantic let me see if I can open my Z palette and tell you. Fervor. I'm wearing Fervor today. I've been wearing Panic like it's my job. Um, craving is amazing. I've been wearing Craving a lot, um, which is, where's it at right here? Craving, me and Nicole Kidman, we've been rocking that one. So, I mean, honestly, I like, I know I only had them for like six or seven days before the end of the month, right? I, I don't care. They're still so good. I had to include them. They might be in my monthly favorites for every month from now until like kingdom come. And the other thing too that has to be in my monthly favorites with them is the wet dry brush that comes with them from NARS. Uh, this is brush 23. It's just, you have to have it to wear, use them wet and you get a flawless like watercolor look. I can't, I just can't with them. They're so good. Um, they're available all over the place now. They'll be in counter at your counter, like at the NARS counters in April, but and we have them at the boutique. So I will go ahead and leave that information down below in case you want to call on the off chance that you'll get to talk to me and order them from us in Los Angeles. If not, you can get them wherever. So anyway, you guys, that was my monthly favorite. Sorry if this is a little bit long. Um, I'm going to insert a video of Shannon right here talking about her tweezers and uh, links for some of that Beautylish stuff down below. Links for or and I also will link the tweezers and all that good stuff rules for the giveaway anyway blah 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 i love you guys you're amazing Mwah!